everybody, this is 22 Tiger Dude here, and welcome to my Blu ray DVD update. Just a Blu ray DVD update on my favorite movie of 2014, Interstellar. It really blew my mind, but it was so mind blowing, it just broke the scale because the movie really hit me so hard. You know, it had the emotions, it had the incredible visuals how the storyline was told with Matthew McConaughey and Hathaway, all the performances being very well done, and Hans Zimmer's score. Oh, oh. Hands down, the best score of 2014. If it weren't for his score, the movie wouldn't be as powerful. It wouldn't have as much impact uh, if it weren't for that score. So Hans Zimmer, Damn great job there. So I did buy Interstellar for $19.99 at Best Buy. If you guys follow me at my Facebook page at facebook.com slash 22 Tiger Dude, I posted a picture how all of the Blu-ray and DVD combo packs for Interstellar were sold out. I went on Friday the 3rd to go buy this movie. So since it was sold out, I went to go to Best Buy, which literally is right next to Target. But yeah, luckily Best Buy had this. It was $20. I don't want to go into too much rambling with this movie. I basically said everything I needed to say for this movie. It's just a great movie and I just absolutely loved it. But I'll go ahead and show you guys the inside. I really love the slipcover to this movie. I think it looks very beautiful. I love how all of that white color just really pops out. I think it would have been pretty sweet if the Blu-ray would have been like white like just imagine if this was a white blu-ray kind of like what they did with birdman you know how with birdman the blu-ray was red or with dawn of the planet of the apes the blu-ray was black i think with interstellar they should have made the blu-ray case white but that's just me personally i like the front and then inside um I, there's this thing called the collectible imax film cell from an annual 70 mm film print Here's a cell right here. I'll give you guys a nice close-up. Oh my god, I had it upside down. Ugh, dumbass Tony. Seriously. Wow. I think it's Murph for what I see in this film cell. I believe it's Murph. You guys could tell me. It is Murph. I did take a closer look. It's re really creative for the Blu-ray case to actually have this. I think that's something really cool. But then right here is a three disc, which I find interesting about this. So this one is the Blu-ray disc. Oh my God, the, speaking of Blu-ray, when I rewatched this movie on Blu-ray, wow. The audio is phenomenal. The picture quality is great, I mean, Seriously, I can't praise the audio and the picture quality enough with the Blu-ray. It just flows so well, so clear, so crisp. Uh, I just had to talk about the Blu-ray quality very quick because I did rewatch this movie on Blu-ray. I will get to the bonus features, which I'm sure I'm going to have a lot of fun with, as according to the Blu-ray, there are going to be three hours. But this is the second disc for the special features. And then, of course, you guys can guess it, this third disc is the film, but the DVD copy. So, I do like how it looks. They could have gone with uh, disc design. I think it would have been cool if they kind of made it look like this cover, or pretty much any other cover you would see in those Interstellar posters. So, I wish for disc art, but I'm not going to really complain about that. I do understand not everybody is going to like Interstellar, and that's fine, you know, there's different opinions out there, but for me, Interstellar is just truly something special. So in the comments down below, you guys, let me know, what did you think of Interstellar, the movie, and if you own the Blu-ray, DVD, combo pack, or really just any feature you bought for Interstellar, let me know what you think of like the bonus features, the picture quality, audio quality, all of that good stuff. And then like what I just said right now you guys, I did do an unboxing video of this movie right here for the universe of the Blue Tubers channel, which I highly recommend you guys because not only does it have me, but you have Seb Carrasco, JW Universe, Jacksig99, Brian Mendoza, and J53518. And I also did do a best films of 2014 
contribute, which I hope you guys could check out. So I'll leave a link to all those things in the description below. Thank you so much for watching, you guys. You all are seriously awesome. This is 22 Tiger Dude here, and don't forget that I will always have Tiger Power. All right, all right, all right. Stellar. I loved Interstellar. I thought it was a very mesmerizing and beautiful take for Christopher Nolan to do in terms of time, love,